I think what's happened is the interview process has started for Ten Hag. They've got a manager who knows he's not going to be here next season and doesn't know whether he's going to be here in the other role that they've offered him. You've got a number of players who don't know whether they're going to be here next season or do know they're not going to be here. And you've got a lot of indecision and uncertainty and a lot of what would be people looking left and right. You need everybody in the dressing room to have blinkers on, everybody in the club to have blinkers on. That's our goal. That's the way we're facing. But they're all looking left and right, thinking, where am I? where's my next move? Is he going to be here next year? The manager's not going to be here, so I better look at what's happening. And it's, you know, we've got the Maguire situation coming out of England this week. Even though I, th I thought he did okay today. You've got the Rashford situation, the Cristiano situation, the Cavani situation, the Pogba situation, the Ranić situation. You've got so many live things happening. And they just need to get to a point whereby basically football stops and that they can reset and they can get a new manager into the club. But that isn't going to just be the answer. There is a, This has been going on for a long time now, this type of feeling. And I feel quite low today. Not in, a, not in an angry way. There's times in the past where I felt angry. I feel quite low tonight having watched that performance because I feel as though another season has just drifted away. And it's been poor all season. Before Ralph Rannick, it was terrible. Other than Solskjaer, I couldn't get anything out of these players. Ralph Rannick struggling to get performances out of them now.